this is deepika patel and welcome to the vedic mathematics class okay so let's start our today's class and today we will be discuss the balancing rule okay so like if you have the number of the double digit let me take an example firstly like if you have the question like this 4 6 7 8 1 2 3 5 Four five, okay. So how can you solve this number by the Vedic mathematics? So we already solved the single series like this six five eight two four. Okay. So we have already seen this question like how can we solve it by the dropping tens method? Okay. Similarly, dropping tens method. Okay. so same method will be applied here but on a single single okay so this dropping tens method once will be applied for this okay and then next will be applied for this and then we will balance balance them and we get the answer okay so i hope you understand so let's start firstly let me clear all those okay so let's take a number like if we have 45927489111 okay so let's solve this so firstly we will take this series okay so 1910 drop a 10 we have 0 0 plus 4 4 4 2 Six and six and five will be eleven. Okay, so drop a ten and we have one here. So you have to write one and count to the all the tens, one and two. So you have twenty one here. Okay, so this is the answer for this series. So we will be right here and separating by it by the line these two parts. Okay, then next we will solve the second series. Which is one eight nine, nine and seven, sixteen. So drop a ten, and we have six here. Six nine will be fifteen. So drop a ten, and we have five here, and five four will be nine. So we have the last number is nine here, and how many tens we have? So one and two. So this is twenty nine. So we have two nine and two one. But this is not the answer because we do not. Get the answer of double digit addition in the fourth digit number. Okay, so uh, always remember if you are doing like double digit addition, double digit addition, so you will get the answer in the triple digit. Okay, and if you are doing like triple digit addition, so you will get the answer in the fourth digit. Okay, so this is the type, and so let's balance this. so what you will have to do you have to just take this one as it is okay and you have to just add the number this so 2 and 9 will be 11 so you have to write one here and one will be the carry here so this will be 311 okay so let's check if it is correct or not 311 is the answer so will will be right here 311 so let's check So one nine ten ten four fourteen fourteen and two sixteen sixteen and five sixteen and five so this will be twenty one okay so we have the number one and two will the carry here okay then two will be the carry here then let's count this one eight nine nine seven nine seven sixteen sixteen and nine Sixteen and nine, so this will be twenty-five. So twenty-five plus four, twenty-nine, and we have here two is the carry. So twenty-nine will be thirty and thirty-one. So this is the answer. So we have the correct answer. Okay. So let's take another example. Like if we have five, four, 
एट नाइन नाइन टू टू वन फाइव एट सेवन सिक्स सिक्स फाइव सेवन फोर सो इट्स क्वाइट अ बिग वन सो लेट सॉल्व दिस फर्स्टली वील टेक द दिस सीरीज ओके सो नाइन फोर सॉरी फोर फाइव नाइन ओके एंड नाइन एंड सिक्स फिफ्टीन ड्रॉप अ टेन हियर वी हैव द फाइव फाइव एंड एट थर्टीन ओके थर्टीन एंड ड्रॉप अ टेन वी हैव द थ्री हियर थ्री वन फोर फोर टू सिक्स एंड सिक्स एंड नाइन फिफ्टीन सो ड्रॉप अ टेन वी हैव फाइव हियर एंड फाइव फोर इज अवर लास्ट नंबर इज नाइन सो वील राइट हियर नाइन and how many tens here 1 2 and 3 okay so this will be 39 separate this then now let's solve the second series so 7 and 6 13 so drop a 10 we have the 3 here 7 3 10 drop a 10 we have the 0 here 0 plus 5 5 5 2 7 7 9 7 9 Sixteen. So drop a ten. We have the six here. Six and eight. Okay. So six and eight will be fourteen. So drop a ten. We have the four here, and four and five is nine. So the last number is nine. Count all those tens. One, two, three, and four. So we have the forty-nine. So now balance this. Forty-nine, thirty-nine. Okay. So we will write nine as it is. Three and nine will be add, so this will be twelve. But we'll take the end number and one will be the carry. So five twenty nine is the answer. Okay. Once you practice more and more questions, so you will be uh, master in this. Uh, okay. So this is not lengthy. This is just simple as it is. But you have to practice more. Okay. So let's take another example. So what is the answer here? Five twenty nine. Okay. Five twenty nine. Let's take another question. So four eight nine two five four six seven eight one nine two eight two seven five four seven. Okay. So here, so let's take this series firstly. Okay, so seven and five. Yes, that is twelve. Drop a ten. We have the two, two two four, four two six. Okay, six one seven, seven one fourteen. Drop a ten. So we have the four here. Four four eight, eight two ten. Drop a ten. We have zero here. Zero plus eight, eight. So last number we have eight. Okay, how many times we have one? Two and three, so this will be thirty-eight. Separate this. So four and seven, eleven. Drop a ten. We have one here, and one eight nine 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 eighteen. Drop a ten. We have eight here. Eight eight sixteen. Drop a ten. We have six here. Six six twelve. Drop a ten. We have two here. Two five seven. Okay. Seven and nine sixteen. Drop a ten. We have six here. Six four ten. Drop a ten. We have zero here. So our last number is, uh, sorry, our end number is zero. So how many tens we have got? One, two. Okay, ha. Huh? One, two, three, four, five, and six. So this will be sixty. Okay. Now, sixty and thirty-eight. So this will be easy for you because eight is at as it is. Three plus zero will be three and six. So six thirty eight is the answer. Okay. So this is how you can solve this double digit series addition. Okay, by the balancing rule. So let me take some questions for you. So you can do at home. Okay. So four, two, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, zero, five, nine, one, two. Three seven one eight one. Okay, you have to solve this. Firstly, uh, make sure you have practiced enough to solve it in your mind. 
without using finger or the pen paper okay so practice more and more questions let's take another question 4 8 9 2 1 3 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 Two. Okay. Let's take one more question. Five. Oh, sorry. Four. Eight. Eight. Four. Nine. Nine. Eight. Eight. Seven. Seven. Six. Six. Five. Five. Okay. So you have to solve this at home, and this is all for today. And in the next class, we will see. Like. today we will see the double digit series addition so we will see like triple digit and okay triple digit balancing rule and also the fourth digit balancing rule okay so four digits means you have four digit additions with a series okay like this type okay so we will see this type of questions and after you seeing uh, after you reach till four digit addition so you can already observe what are we doing in our balancing rule and you can easily solve all those lengthy additions again okay so let's end this class here and thank you for joining the class thank you again